Hey, hi everybody, and welcome to another weekly connection. So we want to talk about how we are the opening door to divine love. So uh, let's get started. All right. So um, I hope you're enjoying these beautiful landscapes of the Sonoran Desert, which is just a love of mine, this desert. And uh, it's like a fairyland. It's not like any other place I've been. Although South Florida used to be pretty amazing, but now it's a lot of cement. But anyway, um, so here we are, and um, we have the entire Carmen board, and um, St. Germain is going to lead us today. So um, I always think it's funny with green screen how the colors of what you're wearing are different. Like this looks black, but it's actually navy blue. And I'm trying to get used to that. I'm not sure how to pick colors for green screen. Anyway, so we're having fun with it. Um, so what does that mean that you are the doorway to the opening of this divine love? And, and St. Germain wants to say that it is coming through our hearts, through our hearts, we are projecting that love onto all of humanity through the collective consciousness. So you want to project and push that light as much as you can, as often as you can. So we're getting to the point where we're getting stronger and stronger about being a light seed. It's getting easier and easier to let go of the old paradigm and to keep ourselves in that light, in love, in kindness and compassion. As the empathic shield develops, and we are getting better and better with that chakra of feeling and understanding of those that are not light, an understanding that keeps us not judging them, but understanding them, knowing that all they need is love, knowing that all that we are all looking for is love. So by projecting love and kindness and compassion, we are able to help ourselves and them transform even more. So in that way, we are that doorway. It is through our hearts that we are creating that light for the whole planet. So let's do it. Here we go. Spraying the aura to get rid of any glomminess, anything that's hanging on, any thought patterns. You know, negative thought patterns cannot stay in the light. A negative thought pattern needs a negative thought to glom onto. So if you don't have those negative thoughts, they can't glom on. So the idea here is to keep your thoughts as positive as they can be and to be light 24 seven. And in that way, it's like a particle that falls to the ground, a negative thought form, when it has nowhere to go, just drops away, it no longer exists. And this is how we are transforming that dark energy out, just out. Like when you put incense into a room, the 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 smoke, you know, the smell, the, the herbs that are in that incense actually fill the air and drop that whatever negative smell was that you were not liking. Well, that's what we do when we're getting rid of these negative thought patterns. You know, they're no longer sticking to our aura, to our energy. It's no longer getting into our mind and wiggling around. Now, when we are vibrating at that higher place through our heart with love, kindness, and compassion, they fall to the ground and no longer exist. So we are that doorway of light. We are the ones by dispelling all of that negativity, we are removing it from the collective consciousness. So what a great task we have. So let's get our cosmic thrust oil. 
We're going to get that drop. We're going to rub our hands together. Bring it into our aura. Cup our hands together. Man, I love this stuff. And we bring ourselves back into oneness, connected, tethered, grounded, so that we can be the light seed that we are. And now we'll connect through that energy because there is no limit in time and space. So let's, let's just meditate. Let's just do this. So you're going to bring that golden light from source and it's going to come down the front and it's going to fill every cell, every pore, every molecule of you. It's going to seek out anything that is not light and make it light. And we're going to bring it all the way down and bring it through our feet and into the earth to the mother. And she grabs on because you're her honored guest. Because it is through humanity that we are transforming the earth vibration to 5D. She will go, but she wants us with her. So let's go. And now we bring it into the, that energy into the grid of the mother. We bring it up our back, comes out the top of our head. And now we orbit round and round round and round. And we feel that orbit of light. We feel that tether and that connection to heaven and earth. And as light seeds, we wear that tether 24 seven, because we are light. And now we bring that energy down. And it comes up out the back, the yin energy, the mother, and it waterfalls out the top of our head, sticking to all 12 of your chakras and your auras. Because we are working the whole system now. And as it sticks to the well of the mother, which is right below the root, we feel that unity, that connectedness to all things, to everything that exists and does not exist to all that we are, and to being the light, to having love and harmony on the planet. You know, that expression in the Bible that the lion will lay down with the lamb means that they don't need each other anymore. There's no predator and prey, but that's another subject. So we feel that energy. And we let that move up into our root, where we feel that root energy dissolving all of our 3D behavior, all of our 3D thoughts, all of those negative thoughts, so that we can be the doorway to that love and compassion. And then we bring it up into our sacral chakra, where, you know, we're doing pretty well at dissolving those silly little paradigms, those dogmas that have been part of the civilization that no longer serve us at all. Because in unity awareness, you don't need a dogma. You don't need a dictation. You just know right action. So we feel that. And we feel that dissolving of all of that misformed energy that made 3D duality. And we are moving into that unity awareness, cosmic awareness, knowing that we are connected to the whole. And we move into the conscious use of power on the spleen. And we remove any conflict you may have, any but, 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 Nope, there are no buts. There aren't any. And we dissolve that. And we move on into the collective consciousness. And we breathe that light. We breathe it in. Two, three, four. Hold. 
two, three, four, release, two, three, four, bring it in, two, three, four, hold and transform yourself, two, three, four, release it to transform humanity, two, three, four, breathe it in, two, three, four, hold that light, two, three, four, and release that light to humanity, two, three, four, breathe it in, two, three, four, hold that light, two, three, four, as it transforms you and others, two, three, four, moving up to the empathic shield on the liver, two, three, four, release, two, three, four, again, in, two, three, four, hold, two, three, four, release, two, three, four, feel that removing all those judgments, you can feel it, two, three, four, hold, two, three, four, release, two, three, four, up into the heart, two, three, four, release, two, three, four, bring it in, two, three, four, transform, two, three, four, share, two, three, four, into your thymus, two, three, four, where our intention is to create this light world, breathe it in, two, three, four, hold, two, three, four, release, two, three, four, bring it in, two, three, four, absorb it, two, three, four, release, two, three, four, as we manifest a light, conscious, kind, loving world, and into your throat, two, three, four, hold, two, three, four, release, two, three, four, breathe it in, two, three, four, hold, two, three, four, and express that love in everything that you do, in all that you are, in everything that you come in contact with in the day, every thought, every word, every action is love. I bring it into the third eye, where we feel so certain that we are these light beings, that we are removing negativity from ourselves. What a bonus. But we're sharing that with the world so that through our heart, through our energy, humanity transforms into a kind and conscious thought process. The collective consciousness is shifting into light. And it is through us that it is doing that. And we bring it into our crown chakra, wear your crown brightly. Dazzle it with the light every day, 24-7. And wear the shield as your telepathic notch opens up. As you no longer judge, then you have compassion for every being, no matter who, what, where, and when because we're all growing, we're all learning. And this 3D duality is soon to be over. So we bring it out into our aura, 18 inches, and we wear it. And we let it munch and crunch because that's how we are that opening door by being the light seed, being the lighthouse that moves this planet out of duality and into consciousness. And we are happy to do it. And we wear that shield and we keep it strong all the time. 
so that we can be the light seeds we came here to be. So feel that love radiating through your heart and your throat, that your expression is love and that you are the doorway. You are the doorway to 5D light and consciousness for planet Earth and humanity. What a good job. What a great thing. And we love being it. So all you have to do is wear your light shield 24 seven. And if something happens that you lose it, just juice it up. I love you and I'll see you next week.